and then try and take a timing off of the spike. If you're still moving when the spike is having a swing, the chances of you getting the ball and doing something with it are pretty slim. Unless it's hit at you, and even then, it's going to be tricky. That was tricky, and Scrimov wasn't going anywhere. He was in a good position. It's well played. Decent side out once again. Brilliant serve. Pekovic to line. Good pass through to Perrin. Pekovic underneath that one, kept short, Kuzmanovic. Katic sets now to Pekovic. Blocked to the back of the court, Walsh is there. Set by the other Walsh and then touched over and Perrin gets the touch. And that is a great point for Canada to take. Pekovic on a roll and Walsh didn't control that. Here it is for Serbia, setting up for Pekovic. Two opportunities there. Canada just survived. Perry. Except for the near side. Perrin. Hogue. Big block. Good. Another very nice pass from Canada, and that means that their setter, Brett Walsh, has all the options open. Some kind of disturbance for the Chinese middle blocker, and it was an easy feed out from China's coach. Oh, Canada with the ball at the net, just able to run everything in zone a lot. Brett Walsh has made the most of it. the Canadian block functioning two of the tallest players on court side by side alongside Canada's tallest player two meters and ten Lucas van Bergen the situation good front line here with the setter Walsh in the backcourt serving he goes off pace today and Jiang gets the ball good dig from De Rocco Perrin not able to get it away die attacks oh that's a fantastic block and a monster block from John Gordon Perrin, the Canadian captain. Walsh, though, the man serving, plays in Belgium for Nacros Lair. And they will be very pleased with what they see from the setter. Decent serve, well passed by Mark. And the pipe is good. Gordon Perrin had relatively few scoring opportunities in this match. That's only his fourth kill for the captain. But he just can't seem to get anything into transition at the moment. Nice pass. Oh, down he goes. And Gordon Perrin, the Canadian captain, has got a monster block to end all monster blocks. Terrific stuff. It's the slowdown blocks as well that don't go on the score sheet. The silent assassin, Stephen Timmons used to call them. Canada lead by five. Another cracker. Shoji knocked over. Oh, they've got him again. It's a hat trick of blocks from Perrin on Matt Anderson, and they are all monster blocks.